Professor Kate Trinastic started her career as a cardiac nurse, but you won't find the heart she discovered in any medical textbooks. It was one of those great moments where we just knew that we had something so significant. After a career change to paleontology, she and her colleagues found a 380 million year old heart and other internal organs from inside a go-go fish near Fitzroy Crossing in the Kimberley. The region has proved to be a treasure trove of ancient creatures for decades. The skulls up there and this tail coming down to here. When the rocks were forming, they contained minerals that preserved their organs. Today, they reveal crucial new details about how we got here. We tend to think of evolution as happening as a series of small steps, but this discovery showed us that in our earliest ancestors, the changes occurred as a big bang all in one hit. Scientists used to use acid to dissolve the limestone and reveal the fossils inside. You'd get a great idea of what the creatures looked like on the outside, but the internal organs, not so much. Well now, thanks to sophisticated new imaging technologies, scientists are able to see the almost perfectly preserved insides. By finding the soft tissue, we can really start to build up this bigger picture of what these ancient animals would have looked like, how they would have lived and, um, and survived. Some of the scientists involved in the discovery now want the region placed on the World Heritage List, preserving the place that has preserved so many clues to our origins. Jake Sturmer, ABC News, Perth.